Yo guys, so in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing this subscriber's insanely stacked Fortnite account. So this account was actually sent in to me by one of my subscribers over on Twitter. Again, if you guys want me to review your Fortnite account for next video, DM me on Twitter. I'm putting it on the screen right now. So as you guys can see, he does actually have this gold trooper equipped. And this is actually a very OG skin. You could only get this skin back in season one, which was obviously a long, long time ago. And yeah, the subscriber actually didn't tell me what skins he actually had, but he does actually have this gold trooper equipped so i'm really hoping he'll have more og skins like imagine if he has the aerial assault or the renegade raider or any more og skins quickly before i start the video be sure to subscribe with all noties on literally less than half you guys who actually watch my videos are subscribed so subscribing helps out so much and why not subscribe it's literally free okay without further ado guys let's just get right into this video so to start off the locker tour we're gonna look at the gliders so it actually does look like he has a lot of gliders as well obviously guys if you watch my channel we always try to find the mako glider first because that is obviously the glider that we really care about okay so he actually does have the mako glider let's go this is obviously a season one exclusive glider and having the mako glider definitely bumps your rating up a lot he also does have the sir glider the brave which is actually a season two umbrella and it looks like he did actually get almost all of the umbrellas of each season as well he does also have the snowflake umbrella which is a season two exclusive umbrella oh and he also does have the cloud strike i actually love this glider so much. Oh, and the Sparkle Specialist Glider as well. So it looks like this guy actually has a lot of rare gliders. So as you guys just saw, that was actually a pretty stacked glider collection. Now, I'm just so excited to check out these pickaxes and skins because I know it's gonna be even better. Okay, guys, so we are now in the pickaxes and we're just gonna do a quick little scroll and look at all the pickaxes he actually has. So it does look like he has a decent amount of pickaxes as well. Honestly, a little bit more than normal, but nothing like crazy stacked, but obviously we care more about the rarity of the pickaxes. So we're just gonna start from the top so he has the harley hitter which is actually a dc series pickaxe and also looks like he has one frozen series axe one gaming legend series axe and only one marvel series axe honestly though it's fine but i really do care about the series sets like the marvel series dc series because i think they are so dope he also does have the sludge hammer did he unlock all the styles sadly he did not actually unlock all the styles to it i really do like the purple variant of the sludge hammer pickaxe okay so it actually does look like he has the acdc which is actually a season two exclusive pickaxe yo let's go this is actually such a rare pickaxe boys and he also does have the candy axe this is one of my favorite pickaxes in the game i think it is so sick the chomp jr i like this pickaxe as well we're just gonna keep going through these though he has the eon blades epic swords of wonder the evo which is actually a season three exclusive pickaxe the fusion scythe ice scepter the merry mint axe yo he actually does have the merry mint axe this is one of my favorite pickaxes in the game as well let me know down in the comment section down below which pickaxe you guys like more the merry mint axe or the candy axe i'm honestly really curious i think i like the merry mint axe more but yeah let me know down below what you guys obviously like more because i'm honestly curious so on sought permafrost power claws rainbow smash reckoning rift edge scorcher he also does have the axe caliber which is a season two exclusive pickaxe let's go we knew this was coming because he did have the acdc obviously and that was more tiers ahead of this one so he had to unlock it the chaos scythe this is actually a very dope pickaxe the dive knives we're just gonna keep going through these let's see if he has anything else kind of rare he also does have the scythe pickaxe i really do like this pickaxe as well i think it is so sick the really blades ripe rippers sawtooth shooting star staff he also does have the sparkle scythe i really do like this pickaxe i've actually made this on my account a few times he also does have the star wand which is one of the most sweaty pickaxes in the game and he also does have the studded axe which is another sweaty pickaxe he also does have a lot of rare pickaxes that i honestly don't want to go over because i don't want to bore you guys out so it looks like we are now in the uncommon pickaxes so he actually does have a decent amount of uncommon pickaxes he does have this pickaxe this is actually a really dope pickaxe the lucky we're getting to the bottom of this list so he has the silent strike throwback axe tree splitter and to end it off he has the default pickaxe honestly guys that was a pretty stacked pickaxe locker it was kind of like the glider locker it's pretty expected honestly but yeah we're just gonna move on to the skins now let's just hope he'll have some more og and rare skins because you never know he is wearing the og skull so i have some high expectations right now okay so it actually does look like he has a lot of skins definitely more than pickaxes and gliders i'm honestly so excited to check out these skins boys so we're just gonna start from the top so he has the lara croft skin the ripley versus sludge obviously he doesn't have all the styles to it which is honestly pretty unfortunate he also does have the ray and the black knight skin which is actually a season two exclusive skin you had to get all the way to tier 60 to get this skin correct me if i'm wrong but i'm pretty sure there were only 60 tiers in the season two battle pass because i'm pretty sure i've messed up instead of 
100 tiers one time. He also does have the black heart, and he also does have every single style to it as well. The Calamity. So it looks like we're going through a lot of Battle Pass skins right now. Honestly, nothing too special. The Gear Specialist, and it looks like you didn't even upgrade the Gear Specialist at all. The Havoc, Heim, Hybrid, Love Ranger, Lux, Lynx, Midas. He actually does have the full gold version of Midas, so let's go. The Omega, and it looks like he has every single style to Omega as well. Omega is honestly so slept on. I think it is such a dope skin. The Ragnarok, Raptor, Raven, Red Knight, Rose Team Leader, Rocks, Ruin. The Reaper, which is actually a Season 3 Tier 100 skin. Let's go. He actually does have this skin. I was actually waiting for this and the Black Knight skin to be in this locker. I'm just really hoping he'll have more OG skins. The Wukong, Zenith, 8-Ball vs. Scratch, Abstract, Agent Jones, Agent Peely, the Alpine Ace Canadian version. This is actually the Nick A30 skin. The Astro, which is actually a really sweaty skin in my opinion. I actually used to wear this during Catch Cups. The Battle Hawk, Brutus. He actually did fully max out the Brutus as well. Let's go. The DJ Yonder, Dusk, Elite Agent. This is actually such a sweaty skin. Ember. We're just gonna keep going through these guys. So he does have the Kuno as well. The Miascos. It looks like he didn't get the full gold tier to this. He also does have the Mogul Master. Not any of the styles. He just has the regular Mogul Master. It's just the blue version, I guess. The Moonwalker, which is a Season 3 exclusive skin. The Nightshade, Nightbeam. Another sweaty skin. Ocean, Onesie, Overtaker, Peekaboo, Peely, Powder, Rabbit Raider. Sidewinder, Siona, the OG Skull Trooper. Let's go, bro. He actually does have this skin. Obviously, we saw this in the beginning of the locker, but I'm just so hyped that he actually has this. Because this is actually such a rare and OG skin. The Sky, Sledgehammer, Snowfoot, the Sparkle Specialist. I actually like this skin more than the Black Knight. You guys may disagree with me on that one, but I would much rather wear the Sparkle Specialist than the Black Knight. The Squad Leader, Stratus, Sub Commander, Summon Strider. We're just gonna keep going through these guys. So he does have the Trailblazer as well. The Wild Wingman, the Blue Squire, which is actually a very rare skin as well. It's a Season 2 exclusive skin. Let's go. The Bright Bomber, the Chromium. I actually really do like the Chromium skin. I think it is super simple and cool. And I wish they made more skins like like this. The Diamond Diva, Double Cross, Dynamo, Fish Stick, Focus, Haze, Hush, Iris. He does also have the Skull Ranger. Of course, he had to buy this because he does have the OG Skull Trooper. The Surf Riders, Tar Tycoon, Turgris Riptide, Wave Breaker, Wooly Warrior, Yellow Jacket, Zadie. So it looks like we are now in the Uncommon Skins, so it does look like he actually does have a lot of Uncommon Skins as well. He has the Nog Ops and the Jolly Jammer. These are my favorite Christmas skins, honestly. Recon Ranger. We're now getting to the bottom of this list. The Star Spangled Ranger, Whiplash. And to end it off, he has the World Warrior, which is actually a very rare skin. Yo, guys, I'm not even gonna lie. This is actually such a stacked skin locker. Okay, guys, so to end off the locker tour, we're gonna look at the emotes. So it actually does look like he has a lot of emotes. He must have some rare emotes. So I was right. He actually does have the fresh emote, which is actually one of the most rare emotes in the game. Let's go. And of course, he does have the floss emote. We knew he would have this. And the flapper, which is actually a very rare emote as well. And of course, he does have the worm emote. We knew he would have this because he does have the Black Knight skin. Okay, guys, so my final rating on this Fortnite account is gonna be a 9 out of 10. This is a very stacked locker with OG skins, so I think it's a solid 9 out of 10. Really good account. I think the only flaws to this account is it doesn't have any more than one OG skin. So obviously, he only has one OG skin. I mean, that's still insane, but that's just not a 10 out of 10. And honestly, a 10 out of 10, the locker would be way more stacked. If you guys want me to review your Fortnite account for next video, DM me on Twitter. I'm putting my Twitter on the screen right now, so go DM me.